What's up, my friends? It's Griff Nelson, your holistic lifestyle hacker. And today I'm going to talk about what I love to geek out on, and that is sugar addiction. And just so you know, um, this is not something that I geek out on because I just like learning about it. I geek out on it because I was a full blown sugar addict for half of my life, and I've coached dozens, uh, hundreds of sugar addicts over my career. And I've seen subtly what it does. And this is the addiction that really pisses me off, right? And here's why it pisses me off. This is an addiction that gets a free pass. I can't tell you how many times I've talked to people and, and they ask what I'm up to. And, and in my past, I made a little course called Sugar Freedom. I've taught it at various corporations and uh, even made an online course. And I can't tell you the reaction. I can't really adequately describe the, the reaction that I get when I say, well, I'm, I'm really up to sugar addiction right now and I'm teaching this course. I get the, what, what? I mean, some people are a little bit more subtle than others, but they can't quite grasp that sugar addiction is actually a real thing. But it's huge. I mean, think about, think about this, at least from a logical standpoint. If you think of what is causing more death and discomfort and disease in the world right now, more than any other addiction, it's sugar addiction. I mean, what causes heart disease? Well, I'm here to tell you without going into great length and debunking all the physiology about cholesterol and saturated fat, which that's not what's causing it, by the way. Um, it comes down to blood sugar control. It comes down to insulin resistance. And sugar itself is a huge, huge, maybe not the exclusive, but absolutely huge culprit in insulin resistance. And insulin resistance is literally the genesis to more downstream diseases like uh, high blood pressure. It's more, it's downstream to high cholesterol, uh, even further down, heart attack, coronary artery disease, you name it. And the reason for this is because sugar is uniquely, uniquely metabolized in the body differently than different carbohydrates. So let's say I have a sweet potato that gives me 120 calories. That 120 calories will be metabolized differently in my body than 120 calories from a Twinkie. Why? Because the sugar content, the fructose component in that Twinkie, sugar, sucrose is 50% glucose, 50% fructose. The fructose component is metabolized hepatically and it is very quickly turned into triglycerides. And those triglycerides add up the pounds, the weight, lead to obesity, which therefore lead to the downstream disease. If you read a lot of experts, uh, chief among them, Gary Tobbs, he talks about, there's a book called The Case Against Sugar, where he talks about really how deadly this, this addiction really is. And this is why I wanted to make this video. I want you to make you aware of the absolute power of sugar addiction and how it can subtly enslave you and you not even know. That's the crazy part. I mean, think about that. You can be addicted to something that is so common, so accepted, socially accepted. There's no religious uh, refutation that I'm aware of. You know, there's no cultural refutation to it. It really is accepted in all walks of life. Now, we understand from a common sense point of view that we don't need to have too much, but the average person that is saying that is addicted to sugar, at least somewhere on that spectrum. Maybe not full blown, but they do have a sugar addiction problem. So I want you to start to become aware of your sugar eating habits. And I'm going to come out with a few more videos and talk about this disease. And I'm going to explain in full detail why this is an absolute game changing addiction that we have to reconcile with, that we have to understand, and that we have to extricate from our life. So anyway, I hope you guys have a great week. Thank you so much for enduring this video, if that's what you want to call it. Um, sugar addiction's real, my friends. Be good to yourself. Be healthy. Remember to never excuse away that inner greatness. And always remember, life 
is good. We'll see you in a bit. Take care.